Hello and welcome back to Bike Matters. Today we have the new 2021 Yamaha MX125. And in this video, I'm going through all that important spec, so stay tuned. So let's start with the engine on the Yamaha NMAX and it is Yamaha's blue core liquid cooled motor that puts out 12.2 brake horsepower and 11.2 newton meters of torque. It is lovely and frugal and Yamaha reckon it should achieve about 185 miles on a full tank of fuel. The engine itself has variable valve technology and there's also start stop technology on it as well. On to styling and I think for a 125cc scooter it looks great, it looks nice and sporty. We've got this blue colorway option here today in that satin finish, I think it looks amazing. We've got these awesome looking twin headlights here and integrated indicators. The wheels are both 13 inch front and back and underneath all of that, we have a new frame as well. And that basically just means Yamaha have been able to fit in a slightly bigger fuel tank and they've structured it so it can take a heavier top box on the back as well for delivery and use. Now the seat height on the Yamaha NMAX comes in at 765 millimeters, which is nice and accessible, though it is worth noting that the seat is quite a wide one, but as you can see here, I'm only short, I'll get both feet down okay. The fuel tank on the Yamaha NMAX is 7.1 litres, which is very typical for a 125cc scooter in this category. When it comes to storage options, we have typical underseat storage on the NMAX, now, it is enough to fit my full-face HJC helmet if I place it in upside down. At the front, behind the leg shield, we have two little cubby holes. The one on the left here is open, but it does have a cigarette charging port. And to the right here, we have a door on this one, but it's not locked. And that's enough for a few small items. The Yamaha NMAX is a premium scooter, and when we get to the dash and the switch gear, you can see that full LCD display which has all your vital information from speedometer, odometer, fuel gauge, it's got you well covered. The switch gear is quality, but if you look down here, you can see it is keyless and we've got this nice dial here as well. So it is a great spec and better still, it's integrated with Yamaha's My Ride app. The functionality will allow you to see when messages and calls are received. On to braking at the front here, we have a 230 millimeter disc and to the rear, we also have a 213 millimeter disc and we have dual channel ABS. Onto suspension and we have telescopic forks at the front and twin shocks to the rear. Now let's get to the business end of the video, the price. The Yamaha NMAX 125 starts from 3,400 pounds. Now I've taken this out on the road and done a full road test review, which is coming to the channel very soon. So make sure to be subscribed for that. If you've liked this video, please give it a like rating. But thank you so much for watching, everybody. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.